Hey everybody, welcome to CR Anti Designers. This is Chetan, and in this Blender tutorial, we are going to create this design, which is not difficult. Once you're able to create this design, then this is very easy to create. So without further ado, let's get started. To create that design, add a plane. Create one segment bevel on its corner words. Use insert operation. Select the face. Use insert operation and use loop tool circle option. Then select these faces and extrude them along the z-axis and then scale down them. Then dissolve these edges and then connect the words in a proper way as like this. Then select these faces. Use small insert operation to have that support to loop structure add there. Then delete one third of the model and add a mirror modifier on it. Now you need to add the support to loop cuts to maintain this 3D form. Then add a subdivision surface modifier and shade smooth it. Now I want to create a curve form add there. So I need to use the set flow add there. If it's not work, use the set linear and then use the set flow. So you can get that curve form, that curve edge. And now it's time to add more details on it. Apply the mirror modifier, select that center face, use the loop tool and then circle option. And create a little bit of design add there. You can select these faces, use the insert operation and then scale them along their normal and then delete these faces. Just add details on the model. Add support to loop cuts on the model so you will get right form on it. Then just select these faces and here I want to create a little bit of design. So I am going to move this edge along the z axis. You need to create that tapper form at there, that slope. So that's why you need to move these edges as like this and try to create that slope form. You can select the words and then connect them. You will get this kind of slope structure. Then you can merge these words as like this and then you can dissolve this edge loop. Then you can dissolve that center edge and create a new edge add there. You can see the loop structure is little bit weird add there. So that's why you need to select the words to create that right loop structure and then connect the words then use the knife tool and try to create that right loop structure add there. Then add a loop cut like this for that sharper edge. Then select faces, use the insert operation and use the loop tool and create a little bit of detail. And now just take the symmetry one more time. There you go. Your design is ready. In this way, you can create this kind of design. Here you can see the different variations I have created. A simple one and another one with the more details. So it's totally depend on you how you are going to take your design to the next level by adding right details and creating good design. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you like this tutorial, then hit that like button and subscribe my YouTube channel. Bye bye, see you in the next video. Take care.